Well, hello, a very warm welcome to you for this evening's game. Regrettably, the weather has been extremely unkind to us here. It is wet and blustery and remarkably inhospitable. Despite all of that, it is good to see that the faithful from both sides have apparently been undeterred. We have a terrific turnout here. The atmosphere is bubbling despite these adverse conditions. All we need now is for the game to live up to its initial billing. Certainly, this is a very, very impressive venue, quite a sight to behold. And from the team sheet, we derive that they are going with a 3-4-3 formation, Jim. Well, I always feel, Peter, that central midfield is a big area of responsibility in this system. It's not as easy for the front three to get behind the ball quickly if one of the wing-backs is, is pushed on then the boys in the engine room have serious cover to provide. So a lot of hard work has to go into this, and at times you can get stretched. But, boy, it can work at one end. There's the whistle. There will be a throw-in. Work on the right flank. Now, what's next? Tries his luck! Oh, that probably deserved better. I have to commend the wing plate, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. And he certainly caught him there, it's a free kick. his foot in there looking to break out here oh, that's a foul free kicks been given can't get the better of his opposite number both sides a bit lacking in intent and that's clear cut it's a free kick the referee has resisted the temptation to go to his pocket it's just a stern lecture The referee's awarded a free kick. Well, the referee has made it pretty clear now that this is his last chance. Well, I think the referee would have told him to rein it in or, or suffer the consequences. Whistle's gone, that's a uh, foul. Brings it forward. And it's got through. They'll try as they might, they just couldn't get into an attacking area. And that's a foul. A simple decision for the referee. It's being played forward. They've got it back as soon as they gave it away.
last act of the first half. So both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. How would you review the first half? I think it's been a very impressive defensive effort. They've never been broken down and contained the opposition attack extremely well. So they head in no further forward. The score here still 0 0. And we are already promptly back underway. Sporting Braga can feel really happy with themselves. The scoreline doesn't back it up, but they've played with urgency and purpose and can't afford to lose patience in this second half. They've got to persevere. And it's played forward. A mixture of good defending and indecisive passing. No progress. And the assistant referee has his flag raised for offside. Gets away from his opponent, gets it back. Tries to get it forward quickly. Well, I don't think it was the wisest option, Peter, once he got into that position. It's not as if he didn't have people nearby. Hoists it forward. has crossed the line and it's a throw ah oh, now some movement on the bench and we are going to see a change well you have to feel a little for the player being taken off here i think he's been made the scapegoat after that but i guess something had to be done i suppose it did need a little change Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. Just brushed off the ball there. Sporting Braga merit full marks for their attitude and application in trying to win this. It means an awful lot, obviously. Forward it goes. Timely intervention. So that's it. It is all over. A uh, frustrating game for attackers on either side. They hardly had a sniff. Defence is broadly in charge. And it has finished goalless. What are your thoughts on today's game then, Jim? Well, neither side could get over the line here. Perhaps one team might be happier, but at the final reckoning, it's honours even. No complaints. So just time for me to say thanks to Jim for his wisdom and to wish you all a very good evening.